zero complex numbers such that mod of z1 plus z2 is equal to mod of z1 plus mod of z2 then argument of z1 minus argument of z2 is equal to negative pi negative pi by 2 pi by 2 or 0 let's check this let z1 equal to x1 plus iota y1 and z2 equal to x2 plus iota y2 and their sum is x1 plus x2 plus iota times y1 plus y2. Now it is given to us that mod of z1 plus z2 equal to mod of z1 plus mod of z2. So let's put all these values over here. So this becomes mod of x1 plus x2 plus iota y1 plus y2 and that is equal to mod of x1 plus iota y1 plus mod of x2 plus iota y2 and we know that mod of any complex number x plus iota y is square root of x square plus y square so this is square root of x1 plus x2 whole square plus y1 plus y2 whole square this is equal to square root of x1 square plus y1 square plus square root of x2 square plus y2 square squaring both the sides we get let me also open this brackets so this is x1 square plus x2 square plus 2x1 x2 plus y1 square plus y2 square plus 2y1 y2 equal to okay this becomes a plus b whole square the formula so this is a square plus b square plus twice of a b so that is twice of square root of x1 square plus y1 square into square root of x2 square plus y2 square so these terms are cancelled out and we have twice of x1 x2 plus y1 y2 equal to twice of square root of x1 square plus y1 square into square root of x2 square plus y2 square cancelling this two and now again squaring both the sides we get x1 square x2 square plus y1 square y2 square plus twice x1 x2 y1 y2 that is equal to x1 square plus y1 square into x2 square plus y2 square multiplying these two we get x1 square x2 square plus x1 square y2 square plus y1 square x2 square plus y1 square y2 square so from here these terms cancelled out twice of x1 x2 into y1 y2 equal to x1 square y2 square plus y1 square x2 square taking this left hand side to the right hand side we get x1 y2 whole square let me write like this y1 x2 whole square minus twice of x1 y2 into y1 x2 this becomes the formula for a minus b whole square right equal to zero and this implies x1 y2 is equal to y1 x2 which further implies y1 over x1 is equal to y2 over x2 y1 over x1 is equal to y2 over x2 now because i know that for z equal to x plus iota y argument of z is tan inverse y over x so taking tan inverse both the sides we get this to be as argument of z1 equal to argument of z2 now taking argument z2 to the other side we get argument of z1 minus argument of z2 equal to 0 so 
D is the right option. Okay, thank you.